For the first fight, we have Godzilla versus the Mutant Creeper. Oh my goodness, so Godzilla is... Is he attacking the sheep? No. So we have the Mutant Creeper right here. And there we go. They are now fighting. And look at that. Godzilla has the uh, fireball ability. He can uh, shoot some fireballs. And uh, of course, uh, the Creeper, the Mutant Creeper is fighting back. Look at that. Is it going to explode right now? Look at that. I think it's going to explode. Oh my goodness. Uh, is it still alive? Yeah, it's still alive. Look at the HP bar. Oh my goodness. So it has a little life right now. And oh my goodness. So it's dead right now. And there we go. It exploded and still Godzilla is alive. Oh my goodness. Next one, we have Godzilla versus the Mutant Skeleton. And oh my goodness, I spawned two Mutant Skeletons right there and they don't care. Look at that. They are not fighting back. Are they even fighting back? No. So, uh, Godzilla keeps on attacking them and they are not fighting back. Look at that. So, uh, the other one noticed uh, Godzilla already right now and they are not using their bows. What? is going on there we go there we go so this uh, mutant skeleton has special ability it can actually summon rain of arrows but uh, they are still not using that and as you can see the HP of mutant skeleton oh my goodness so the bones are scattering all over the place and look at that look at that power right there Oh my goodness, so he's shooting uh, Godzilla right now. I'm not sure if uh, is Godzilla trap. He cannot go to uh, the Wither Skeleton. He cannot attack the Wither Skeleton right now. There we go. So I guess he escaped the trap. There's something, uh, there's some kind of a trap whenever there's a hole uh, created uh, on the ground just like this. Especially for uh, big creatures like Godzilla. And there we go. There's a rain of arrows dropping, and oh my goodness, uh, Godzilla just keep on uh, keeps on fire uh, firing. Uh, oh my goodness, he cannot hit the Wither Skeleton. What is going on? So he cannot hit the Wither Skeleton. I mean the Skeleton, mutant Skeleton, uh, using those fireballs. But oh my goodness, what is he doing? The mutant Skeleton is camping. <laughs> Oh my goodness, there we go. Oh, there we go. So he can definitely hit uh, the mutant skeleton with those fireballs. And uh, there we go. So he just killed uh, the mutant skeleton. Look at the bones. Oh my goodness. Next fight, we have uh, Godzilla versus uh, the mutant snow golem. There we go. They are now fighting. And I'm not sure if the mutant snow golem can survive this. Oh my goodness. It's like uh, just three hits and the mutant snow golem is dead. Oh my goodness. Next one we have the mutant villager versus Godzilla. There we go. And Godzilla is attacking the mutant villager but I'm not sure if he can actually hurt the mutant villager. It seems that... Oh my goodness. Can you... There we go. So he definitely can hurt the uh, mutant villager but looks like the mutant villager is not fighting back he is not fighting back look at the HP it's regenerating there we go what he actually uh, damage deal damage uh, to himself using uh, those fireballs and right now oh my goodness this is not a fight look at that the HP of the mutant uh, villager is regenerating right now and uh, Godzilla just keeps on uh, firing. Oh my goodness, look at that. So whenever he uh, is going near to Godzilla, he is actually dealing damage to himself. There we go. And the, the only thing that is giving damage to Godzilla is uh, his own uh, fireballs. There we go. So looks like... Uh, the mutant villager is mad right now there we go so i think he just killed the mutant villager is he going to regenerate no 
Next one we have the mutant drowned zombie versus uh, Godzilla. And let's see, this is going to be interesting. So same as uh, the mutant villager, this uh, mutant drowned a while ago seems not to care but right now oh my goodness he summons the lightning and looks like Godzilla right now is badly hurt he is turning red oh my goodness this is an awesome fight this is so noisy this fight is so noisy because of the lightning bolts everywhere oh my goodness so he summoned his minions but let's see what will happen can he sustained this I'm not sure who is leading this fight but right now uh, he can definitely hurt the uh, I mean Godzilla this mutant the uh, drowned zombie can definitely hurt Godzilla there we go and there goes the minions right there and uh, this Godzilla actually uh, is dealing a lot of damage to mutant creatures so he is dealing his attack damage is so powerful actually and looks like they are not fighting anymore i don't know why there we go so just go there and fight come on there we go uh looks like oh there we go so there uh, there goes the lightning bolt once again striking the godzilla i mean godzilla and uh let's uh let's take a look at the hp mutant round uh, the HP is regenerating but it's it's too little right now it's less than half and let's see if he can even kill a Godzilla because uh, of course we we can see that uh, Godzilla is taking a lot of damage as well and they they stopped a while ago but they are now uh, continuing the fight there we go oh my goodness he jumped he jumped towards the body of Godzilla. Oh my goodness. That's awesome. He just killed Godzilla. Oh my goodness. Next one. We have uh, the Mutant Vindicator versus Godzilla. Let's see. Let's see if the mutant creature from the Woodland Mansion can kill Godzilla. There we go. So Godzilla attack first. And uh, the Vindicator is dealing damage right now, taking damage I, uh, I mean. And there we go, look at the HP, looks like Godzilla doesn't want to attack him anymore. But a while ago he's attacking uh, the Vindicator using fireballs and can he even hurt uh, the Vindicator? What? What? He's attacking the cows, the other mobs. And looks like this Vindicator is not fighting back. So I, I guess we don't have a match right now. So let's go to the next one. Next we have the Mutant uh, Piglin Brute. Oh my goodness, I summoned two. Okay, so there goes the Piglin Brute. Uh, Mutant Piglin Brute uh, versus Godzilla. And Godzilla will attack first. And the question is, will the Mutant Piglin Brute attack back? Uh, because if he doesn't want to fight back, then there's no match okay so let's see what will happen so definitely godzilla can hurt him and there we go he is fighting back he has uh, that special attack uh, where he summons stalagmites from the ground those are the spikes from the ground made of dirt and uh, that is dealing damage to godzilla oh my goodness uh, we're not sure by how much and there we go there goes his signature attack the whirlwind attack using the axe and the sword oh my goodness but looks like he cannot reach godzilla and godzilla is just firing those fireballs and he also has another attack looks like he's going to throw something and what godzilla is turning red when he is doing that oh my goodness oh my goodness this fight is so awesome okay this piglin brute uh, right here has so many special powers and look at that he is now summoning more stalagmites right here and godzilla oh my goodness he can also jump high and he can attack the body of godzilla oh my goodness so just like the drowned zombie a while ago uh he actually uh dealt the final blow to godzilla killing godzilla a while ago so let's see if this piglin brute can uh, also do that 
All right, so uh, here goes the whirlwind attack again. What? Godzilla is attacking the other mobs. I'm not sure what happened there. There we go. So attack, attack right now. Oh my goodness. Uh, both of them are turning red. Ah, maybe because uh, the piglet root is too near to Godzilla, and we know that uh, Godzilla has the melee attack. And there we go. Looks like if uh, Godzilla's uh, enemy is too uh, near, he cannot actually deal damage using those fireballs. And uh, look at that. They are both turning red right now because they are using their melee attack a while ago. And there we go. We cannot see the HP of Godzilla, so we... Uh, we don't have idea if Godzilla is dying right now and looks like this uh, piglin brute is dying is he dying okay let's take a look at the HP looks like it's uh, almost half it's less than half actually and there we go oh my goodness look at the HP so when he goes near to the Godzilla oh my goodness he is taking a lot of damage and looks like he will kill this piglin brute oh my goodness what a fight next one we have a uh, mutant zombie versus godzilla and let's see okay so this mutant zombie has the same ability as the mutant villager so uh we will not be surprised if uh, this mutant zombie will not attack uh, Godzilla because they have the same behavior as the villager. But there we go. So it looks like he is attacking right now. And another special ability of this uh, mutant zombie is that he can summon minions. Of course, those are zombies, but that's going to be a disadvantage because uh, right now it's daytime, so they will get burned. And right now, this mutant zombie is also uh, getting burned. And uh, there we go. Looks like he's powerful as well, but Godzilla is, of course, bigger. And uh, what is happening? There we go. Oh my goodness. So he's mad. Uh, this mutant zombie is mad right now. He's just slamming the ground. And when he do that, he is actually turning uh, the grass blocks into uh, dirt. And there we go. So uh, Godzilla just keeps on firing right now. And what is going on? There we go. So there goes the the attack wherein he's going to jump and he slams the body and what what oh my goodness so the mutant zombie is dead right now just like that what is he dead is he dead already who is, who are you attacking oh my goodness next one we have the mutant pig zombie versus godzilla and uh, this pig zombie is holding a, a gold sword and there we go he can definitely hurt godzilla right now and uh, using melee attack so uh he doesn't seem to have a uh, range attack so only of course his weapon is uh, a golden sword so it's only a melee attack and uh, it's actually a big disadvantage uh, when you are uh, going up against uh, Godzilla because Godzilla has uh, both uh, attacks the melee attack and the range attack as well But let's see if he can actually win this fight looks like uh, the pig zombie is trapped there we go so they are now continuing the fight and uh, What is going on? Looks like the fireballs are coming out of the neck or chest of Godzilla, not uh, from the mouth. <laughs> oh my goodness. But there is something coming out of his mouth aside from the fireballs. Look at that. It's like a laser. Laser but not red. It's like laser but uh, the color is like smoke. And there we go. Looks like the pig zombie is dying right now look at the HP it's very very low and uh, Godzilla will just keep on attacking and uh, this pig zombie can also jump high but he is dying right now I guess he resurrected oh my goodness so let's see what will happen look at the HP of the mutant zombie pigman it's now 100% uh, and what oh my goodness just one hit from 
Oh, good, Silla. And he is down. But he is resurrecting right now. And this is going to be his third life. And let's see what? What? They are very far from each other. So maybe we can do the TP at E at P. So it's gonna be TP at E at P. And there we go. Oh my goodness. So there are other mobs right here spawning. And let's see. Are you going to continue your fight? Oh my goodness. The pig zombie is killing pigs. Oh my goodness. There we go. So they want to continue the fight. And looks like Godzilla cannot hit the pig zombie right now. So whenever he throw, he shoot those uh, fireballs, and uh, the enemy is very near to him. Uh, it doesn't, it doesn't seem to hurt the enemy. And look at that! Did he just kill the pig zombie? No! Oh my goodness! This is the fourth life of the pig zombie. But he's kneeling right now. He's kneeling right now, and uh, he wants to attack more. Come on! Attack the Godzilla. I mean attack Godzilla. What? He is he trapped? He's trapped once again. So again, uh, we need to use the slash TP at E at P so that uh, they will uh, teleport to me. There we go. And let's see. Oh my goodness, he jumped once again. He attacked the body of a Godzilla. Oh my goodness. Let's see. Let's see, there we go. Looks like he is attacking Godzilla, but uh, Godzilla is not taking damage. What is going on right now? Godzilla is going backwards. Okay, there we go. There we go. So he can hurt Godzilla right now. And looks like this is going to be the end. Is it going to be a, the end? Oh my goodness, so that's the fifth life. He has so many lives. What is going on? And uh, it doesn't seem like Godzilla can hurt him anymore. What? Godzilla cannot hit, hurt him anymore? He, this big zombie is not turning red. It means it's not... Oh, there we go. So he can take damage. Especially if Godzilla is too, uh, too near to him. And there we go. Is he dead? Yes. He is dead. And Godzilla is attacking the other pigs. Oh my goodness. So we have uh, the next enemy. It's going to be... What? It's not that one, it's gonna be uh, this one. It's the uh, Mutant Snow Golem X. It's actually better than the Mutant Snow Golem uh, regular. And uh, let's now summon here uh, Godzilla. There we go. Are they even fighting? Are they even fighting? There we go. So looks like uh, Godzilla attack first. And there we go. So uh, this uh, Mutant Snow Golem X has the special ability. Uh, just like the other mobs, he can summon spikes from the ground, but this time it's gonna be uh, snow or ice spikes. And looks like uh, with that, Godzilla can actually not go near to uh, uh, this snow golem right here, but he is burning. That's the reason why he is taking damage. Now, this mutant snow golem X is actually more powerful than a regular uh, mutant snow golem. He has more health of course and he is throwing uh, the ice right now and it's dealing damage it's uh, it's dealing damage to Godzilla and let's see what will happen so uh, I think this is going to be a very long fight uh, because uh, I'm not sure how much damage is uh, this uh, ice blue ice dealing to Godzilla because looks like it's it's not that powerful uh, attack, but uh, Godzilla is still taking damage from the spikes uh, coming from the ground, just like that. And let's see if uh, this Mutant Snow Golem X can beat Godzilla. And the only thing that is uh, dealing damage to the Mutant Snow Golem X uh, are, is the fire, actually. But uh, yeah, it's it's gonna be a snow versus a fire, or ice versus Fire. and looks like Godzilla when he is fighting uh, the mutant snow golem X Godzilla cannot use his melee attack only the fire balls and I'm not sure about that and this is going to be an advantage to the mutant snow golem X and look at the HP guys 
Look at the HP of the Mutant Snow Golem X. It's still 100% so he can definitely regenerate his health. And uh, let's just wait who will win this fight and looks like I guess it's gonna be the Mutant Snow Golem X because there's no way that uh, Godzilla can reach the Mutant Snow Golem X and uh, the HP of the Mutant Snow Golem X is regenerating so uh, the melee attack of Godzilla is so powerful but the problem is he cannot reach his enemy this time because of the spikes and because of this snow here I'm not sure oh there we go so he just killed Godzilla that is so awesome next one we have Godzilla and regular mutant enderman okay I said uh, mu uh, regular mutant enderman because we still have the mutant enderman X later just in case the mutant uh, enderman cannot kill Godzilla and it looks like oh my goodness uh, is he teleporting there we go so he can re uh, he can hurt Godzilla using the melee attack and uh, the reason why Godzilla cannot hit him using the fireballs is that uh, he uh, the mutant enderman is teleporting but look at this power coming from the mutant enderman oh my goodness look at those power oh my goodness so he will turn into a uh, multiple ghost enderman ghost and uh, he will return back to his old form just like this so when he is mad when he is fighting uh, he will transform into an enderman with four arms actually what is going on i'm trapped a while ago oh my goodness so he just killed the mutant enderman okay lastly we have the mutant enderman x which is more powerful than the mutant enderman versus Godzilla. Let's see if the Mutant Enderman X can kill Godzilla this time. And uh, of course it's much much more powerful. He, uh, he has more HP and uh, look at that. Godzilla can hurt him uh, using those parables but uh, look at the HP it's quickly regenerating. So uh, the only thing is that uh, this Mutant Enderman X should not go very close to Godzilla because Godzilla is so powerful his melee attack is so powerful he can actually kill a single mutant uh, creature with just one blow a while ago i'm not sure what's that uh, mutant creature but he did that a while ago and uh similar to the mutant enderman uh, this mutant enderman x has the power to become ghosts multiple ghosts actually and attack the enemy and i want to see his ultimate power just like the mirror enderman uh there we go what what's that what what is that what why there's fireball going this way oh there we go there's the ultimate power of the mirror enderman it looks like oh my goodness what did he just freeze the godzilla is that a part of his what is that what what is that what is going on? Who is he fighting? What happened to Godzilla? Godzilla is here. What? And uh, looks like the middle Enderman X is fighting someone here. Very similar to Godzilla. What? What is going on? Oh my goodness. So uh, maybe we can uh, do the TP at E at P so that we can teleport Godzilla because where's the other godzilla where's the other godzilla uh is he is he dead uh let's try to make sure where is godzilla i guess he's dead oh my goodness shout out to the following dominica wasik baker's mom blog jj cantalejo amanda amerson warisela channel stephanie smith busy place limian peng naganda vran daniel purba and personal email thank you so much Have you ever felt are you listening damn